I know I've said this quite a few times. This particular time to bring it up and talk about it is very valid. Mental health is extremely important to me. I think we're all vastly different and I love that about the human race. We're not all meant to fit inside of these boxes. We're supposed to behave like, we're supposed to talk like, we're supposed to, you know, do everything a very certain way. And I'm just really tired of it where expectations are placed on us instead of organically doing and acting and behaving and taking steps towards things that are genuinely going to make you happy. These all sound like excuses, people like that don't understand me and think that I don't want to go to social events because of something to do with their personality or the way that I feel about them. I've changed and when they knew me many, many years ago, number one, who doesn't want to change? I mean, if you don't change, isn't that the point of life is like evolving and changing? I suppose it's different whenever it's from an aspect of someone's opinion where they're like, I don't think you should have changed this because I liked you better that way. You want to be yourself and your true, true authentic self and you want the person that's with you or beside you or the people that are aligned with you to enjoy you for who you truly are. I don't feel it's necessary anymore to try to impress anybody or be something I'm not. Put myself in circumstances where I'm going to feel like the inside of my body is crawling onto the outside and like potentially screw up and say stupid things sometimes because of nerves. I don't want to put myself in circumstances like that anymore. Um, you know, you've changed from when I first met you. You didn't really have social anxiety. You didn't reflect social anxiety. This was never an issue before what happened to you. Overindulged in alcohol in order to mask my fear. Being consumed by other people's energies. For a lot of years, being directly affected by other people and their personalities. Because I put myself in so many circumstances weren't the best for me. Decisions that I made out of those circumstances were bad and not, um, didn't affect my life in a really great way. I don't wanna ever go back to alcohol. I don't ever want to drink again. So many circumstances where my partner social gatherings or you know i've been invited to so many things I was on the precipice of never say forced because nobody can force me to do anything and maybe that's my ego that i'm learning about and getting to know but because of the fear of wanting to support my partner him down that has always <sighs> I don't want to let anybody down I'm gonna try harder to understand why how I got here, how we can fix it moving forward, right? Because we don't want to stay in this label. We don't want to stay in this space of, I have social anxiety. I fear absorbing other people's energies. I'm, I'm very sensitive and I get very overwhelmed very easy. And I didn't put on anybody what I go through internally when I'm in a larger setting of people. I wouldn't put it on anybody. I wouldn't 
put it on my worst enemy. Put me in those situations. It doesn't seem to bother them. It always kind of turns back around to it being about them. I don't want to stay in this space where And the biggest part of this is that I have a son and I love my son. I love my son. Harmony between son and I is unmatched. Like nobody understands us. A very wonderful, beautiful, unique and artistic cosmic way. And I feel like I want to be with him every moment of every day and just guide him beautifully, eloquently through life. Smartest boy I've ever seen in my life. He's just a genius in every way and makes me happy. I feel better now. I'm pretty stoned. Put on a nice movie. I was trying to confide in my partner. Before I even had an opportunity to say what was plaguing me or bothering me, <laughs> knew that it was due to the weather change in flux. And if you've seen my past videos, you know that I love being outside. I love nature. I love connecting with Mother Gaia. I love putting my feet on the ground. I love giving back to the earth, to our planet, and you know, um, surrounding myself with people who understand that is very refreshing and tends to be the only time that I don't get social anxiety is when I'm with a group of people who truly understand me, same kind of wave as they are. It makes it much easier for me, not better completely, but definitely easier.